Ich war an diesem Tag 60 Jahre alt. I was 60 years old that exact Monday. I had given the last 30 years of my life working for just one company. Even without a higher education degree, I managed to work my way up from the bottom, all while raising three kids. I went from a minimum wage position to supervising a staff of eight. I was proud of what I had accomplished. It took just five minutes of those 30 years to fade away. Not even a thank you as I was escorted onto the street and into chaos. As I passed the bank that held my savings, I knew it wouldn't last long. My husband took care of those things, but he was gone. Six months now. I found myself near sunset, strolling the beach. I felt lost, alone, cold. As the sun abandoned me too, I recalled something my husband used to repeat, what he called financial words of wisdom. He said it's not about how much money you earn, but how much money you can keep. In desperation I gathered all of our financial records. Apparently his last act of love for me was a visit to a financial consultant he trusted to invest a small pension. That's when I found out where he had first heard those words of wisdom. The next morning I paid that consulting firm a visit. No, I found out I'm not rich, but I will survive. If not for my husband's trust in them, who knows where I would be now? Working odd jobs? No more holidays? Living on the streets? My advice to you? Protect yourself. Invest earlier in your future and don't live only for now. When you least expect it, the loyalty you give them won't be returned. You will either sink or swim. Make sure you have a life raft. And don't count on government. You might drown. Sie könnten ertrinken. Grab your copy of The Poverty in Retirement 2.0 It will explain everything you need to know, the real truth about your pension.